Jeanette Rankin was born on June 11, 1880, near Missoula, Montana, Olive Pickering Rankin and John Rankin. She was eldest among the six siblings. While her mother was a school teacher, her father worked as an immigrant carpenter and rancher. Since Jeanette was the eldest child of the family, she assisted her parents in daily chores and outdoor works. She also took care of her younger siblings. Hardworking and laborious, she helped maintain the ranch machinery. Academically, Rankin attended high school and later enrolled at the University of Montana. She graduated in 1902 with a B.Sc. degree in biology. Jeanette Rankin was the first woman elected to U.S. Congress. At the time when Rankin was elected to the United States Congress, female participation in politics was unheard of. Rankin's entry into politics was a gradual process. She started off as a social worker, lobbying for women's suffrage movement. It was due to her tireless efforts that the 19th Amendment was passed which secured women the right to vote across America. Though the feat was a remarkable achievement in Rankin's political career, it was her pacifist foreign policy that defined much of her congressional terms. Rankin became the only member of the Congress to vote against the U.S. entry into World War I and World War II. While her opposition for World War I received support from 49 other congresspersons, her pacifism against World War II raised outrage as she was the only person to vote against war. Rankin's adamant pacifist stance was noteworthy. Though her commitment towards anti-war sentiments was largely ridiculed for much of her life, it was only towards the end that she became an inspiration for numerous other women activists and pacifists.